Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to this matchup in the Axis Football League. This is Dave Stevens. With me, as usual, is analyst Mike Steele. Dave, as we both walked up to the booth, it's palatable in the air. Not just the players and the coaches, but also the fans, the trainers, heck, the concessions guy gave me extra nachos. Everyone's amped for this game. There's no doubt about that. I think that both of these teams have something to prove today. Makes the throw. That will bring up second down. He takes fumble on the field. Brought down at the 15. This one's going to put him in the doghouse, Dave. Might see the backup come in on those key downs going forward. The away team will be looking to turn that turnover into some points here. Go! The quarterback hands it off. Second down. The away team from the gun. Go! Number 37 on the run. He crosses the goal line. Touchdown! Huge credit goes to the blockers on that touchdown. That really paved the way right into the end zone. The kick is up. It's good. The away team strikes first today. Seven, nothing. Any touchdown deflates a team, Dave. But giving up on the first score of the game just takes it to another level. Number five. Rockets this one deep. Let's see what the offense can do with this drive. I'm sure they'd love to go down and put an end to this lead they're facing. Drops back into the pocket. He hurls one. Stop. First down. Nothing puts the defense on their heels like a quick first down. It backs them up and keeps them guessing. Drops back into the pocket. Makes the throw. And he's tackled by number 26. Second down. Said Ike. He tosses one across the goal line near the middle of the field. And it's off. Pitching it off to number 23. That'll bring up fourth down. That's a safe play on third down. When you've got a long way to go, sometimes you're better off just picking up a few yards and kicking it. Hike. The kick is made. And he's good from 48 yards out. The home team recovered some ground with that score. Seven, three, so the fans that left are maybe starting to wish they hadn't. Hang on to your seat, folks. The away team comes into this drive with a one-possession lead. I'm looking for them to try and take a chunk of time off the clock and grab another score. Did I... He dodges away. That'll give them a fresh set of downs. This line today, regardless of who is in the backfield, they're making it a point to create those running lanes. He hands it to number 40. 
That brings up second down. A penalty marker on the play. The home team takes the penalty. There really is no excuse for false starts because you know the snap count. Second down and long. Go! The quarterback dropping back, throws it across the first down line. That gets us to third down. Lining up with five DBs. Drops back into the pocket. Incomplete pass. The away team comes out in punt formation. Go. He punts it away. Taken at the 18-yard line. If the offense can drive down the field and get some points here, I'd expect to see a big momentum shift in the game. Go. He drops back. Finds a target out past the first down marker. That will bring up second down. He pitches the ball to the runner. That brings up a crucial third down. Third down and short. Hike. He tosses it to the runner. And he won't make it very far before being dragged down. Being able to move the ball in the running game, especially, especially when you can pick up a first down, gives you so many options in terms on play calling. The quarterback with the handoff. That'll bring up a fresh set of downs. He drops back to pass. The tight end on the reception. Second down. Second and short. Go! Number 15, handing it off. When you can pick up the first by running, it really opens up your playbook for the next set of downs. The runner steps out of bounds up at the two-yard line. Huge play here, Dave. Nearly broke it wide open. They've got the makings of a fantastic drive here. He pitches the ball, and he's in for the score! Gardner showed great vision on that run, hitting the gap at the right time to shoot into the end zone. The kick is up. It's good! The home team will take the lead with that score. 10, 7. The home team slides into the driver's seat with the go-ahead score. Riddle kicks it away. If the offense can drive down the field and get some points here, I'd expect to see a big momentum shift in the game. Go! He sets up and throws near the middle of the field. Zed Hut. 
throws a pass, and it's picked off by number 34. Brought down by number 8. I'm sure the coaches had talked to him about this one with him all week. Just a bad read exploited by the secondary. As an offense, the best way to show appreciation to the defense for forcing a turnover is to go drive down the field and turn it into a score. There is a flag on the play. The pitch is taken by number 23. We'll see if the penalty affects the outcome. The home team takes the penalty. Seeing a lot of pointing from both sides of the ball, but it was clear that the defense Tonight. jumped on that one. Number 87 makes the completion. Third play of the drive for the home team. Number 15 dropping back. Caught. That gets us to second down. Makes the toss to number, and he steps in for six. Touchdown. The home team showed us great execution and determination on that touchdown. <laughs> Riddle kicks it up. It's good. The home team adds another score. 17-7. The home team is really moving out in front of this matchup. Riddle kicks a deep one into the end zone. Miller catches the kickoff. And he's brought down after a return of. That signals the end of the first quarter. The home team with the lead. 17-7. They'll start things off from the 16. He drops back to pass. Finds a target past the first down. And they can't connect. Incomplete. He steps back to pass. Heaves a pass deep downfield to the sideline. He can't make the catch. The offense will operate from the gun. Throws one down the middle of the field. And they can't connect. Incomplete. Hike. He punts it away. Number 32 takes the punt. The home team needs to play it smart here. They're in control of this game and need to focus on not making mistakes. Number 15, pitching it out. That will bring up first down. Go. The quarterback, back to pass, finds a target. Tackle made. Hike. Number 15, handing it off. Third down. Pitches it out to number 23. That'll bring up a fresh set of downs. A successful rushing attack makes the defense pull that eighth man into the box, which then opens up the passing game. Pitching it off to number 26. That will bring up second down. Coming out in the three receiver set. Hike. 
He throws one. And they can't connect. Incomplete. I used to love seeing the wideouts look at their hands after a drop, as if the ball that I just threw them bit them or something. Just catch the ball. Passes <laughs> one to the back. Finally taken down by Howard. Passes one to the back. The home team comes out with two backs. Go! The QB makes the top. He steps in for six. Short runs on the goal line are all about the blocking up front. I credit them for that touchdown. Riddle kicks it up, and it's good. The home team adds to their score, 24-7. That's a big score for the home team. Riddle kicks it. The away team has dug themselves into quite a hole here. They've got a chance to regain some of that on this drive. Steps into the pocket. Launches a pass. Caught. He's taken down. Back-to-back -back first downs really has an impact on the crowd, too. Hike. Number 16. Back to pass. Incomplete. Throws a pass across the first down line. And he misses his mark. Let's see what the call is on third down. He can't bring it in. The kicker kicks it up. And he's good from 59 yards out. The away team bridges the gap a bit. 24, 10. The away team got the ball rolling with that score. Now, they need a big stop and another score to keep the momentum going. The offense needs to just play it safe here and focus on keeping the ball in their possession as long as possible. Number 15 steps back into the pocket, and they can't connect incomplete. Second down for the home team. Go. The QB looking to pass. Snagged out of the air by number 23. Third down and short. Hike. The QB makes the handoff. That'll bring up a fresh set of downs. When you can pick up the first by running, it really opens up your playbook for the next set of downs. Hands it to number 23. Second down. Second down. Go! The QB makes the toss. And he won't make it very far before being dragged down at the 49-yard line. That gets us to third down. Hike. He makes the handoff. 
Brought down almost immediately up near the 49. Not a run that's going to make his highlight reel, but he keeps adding to his yardage today with that first down. <laughs> Number 15 tosses one out. Drops back into the pocket. Throws the ball near the sideline. That will bring up first down. A fresh set of downs for the offense. <laughs> Number 15, handing it off. Second down. From under center. Go. Pitches it out to number 26. That will bring up third down. Center. Drops back into the pocket. The ball falls to the ground. Incomplete. Even though that pass was incomplete, those are the types of throws that stretch a defense. The D was up to the challenge that time. <laughs> Riddle on the kick, and he makes it from 25 yards out. The home team adds to their score, 27-10. They just keep pouring it on, Dave, but that's the competitiveness of this league. You can't let off the throttle. The offense needs to get to work here. They've got an uphill road ahead of them to retake the lead and would do well to get things rolling now. He throws one. And they can't connect incomplete. Drops back into the pocket. He tosses one deep down the center of the field. The ball falls to the ground, incomplete. Let's see what the call is on third down. The QB handing it off. The home team takes a timeout here. That brings up fourth down. The away team comes out in punt formation. Number 13 on the punt. The kick is caught at the 21-yard line. The offense needs to just play it safe here and focus on keeping the ball in their possession as long as possible. Quarterback to pass. He flings a pass near the middle of the field. It's not always the wide open guys you throw to. The later in the progression you get, the more you gotta thread the needle. <laughs> Airs one out. The pass falls harmlessly to the ground. <laughs> Number 15 steps back into the pocket. The home team uses their second timeout. Go. Steps into the pocket, sets his feet and throws out to the sideline. The receiver can't bring it in. Two receivers for the home team. Number 15 steps back into the pocket. The receiver can't bring it in. Tight end right for the home team. Dropping back. 
throws it deep down the field. And he can't reel it in. Sometimes you have to have that gunslinger mentality and take a shot to keep the defense on their toes. It didn't work out that time, but it will still let the D know that this QB isn't afraid to test them deep. And it's good. The home team adds another score, 30-10. We've talked about it a few times, Dave. They're really playing a complete game this go-round. Riddle rockets this one deep. The away team has dug themselves into quite a hole here. They've got a chance to regain some of that on this drive. The quarterback drops back. Throws one to the middle of the field. And he's taken down up near the 35. That will bring up first down. A fresh set of downs for the offense. <laughs> Throws over the middle. The tackle is made by number 32. The away team will use their first time out here. When you can keep the sticks moving quickly like that, it's a good way to build momentum on a drive. Here's the kick. And he split the uprights for three points. That's good from... That marks the end of the second quarter. The home team out in front, 30-13. Reynolds sends this one into the end zone. Let's go down to our own Emma Adams, who has an update for us. Gentlemen, I had a chance to discuss the first half with the coach for the home team. He said that he was proud of the way his guys were battling, even though they were down by several points. He also said they'll need to continue playing with this much heart if they expect to get back into the game. Back to you, Dave. We appreciate the update, Emma. Scrambling. Stop by Smith. With that first down, the QB gets a bit more comfortable, which really helps his confidence going forward. Number 37 on the run. That will bring up second down. <laughs> Number 16 steps back into the pocket. Complete. And that's enough for a first down. Let me tell you, Dave. Hearing those chains move is one of the best sounds to the offense. <laughs> he shakes off the tackler. That gets us to second down. Second down. Handing it off to number 27. Third down. Third down and short. <laughs> the handoff is taken by number 37. A penalty flag on the field. Well, we'll see if that holds up after the penalty. The home team accepts the penalty. Dave, it really does happen on every play. And being honest, who am I to judge a lineman protecting his quarterback? Number 16 steps back into the pocket. And he's brought down by Smith. That'll give them a fresh set of downs. First and ten.
Tonight. Number 16, dropping back. Good enough for a first down. First and goal. Tonight. Handing it off to number 37. Second down. Hands it to number 37. That brings up a crucial third down. Looking to punch this one in on third down. Number 16, dropping back. It's caught for the score. This receiver, such a good wingspan. He's got the ability to get that ball even when the ball isn't perfectly passed. There's the kick. It's good. The away team recovered some ground with that score. 30, 20. What they need now is a big stop on defense to keep the momentum shifting. Number five sends it off. The home team needs to play it smart here. They're in control of this game and need to focus on not making mistakes. Quarterback to pass. Tosses the ball deep off to the left side. And that's enough for a first down. The offense is giving the chain gain a workout down there. They were barely set before needing to move. Drops back into the pocket. Throws the ball out past the first down marker. He's tackled up at the 33-yard line. Good enough for a first down. Those quick first downs like that really help the offense get into a rhythm. Pitches it out to number 23. That will bring up second down. Number 15, back to pass. Incomplete. Incomplete. Tonight. There's the kick. It's good. They convert from 48 yards out. The home team widens their lead. 33-20. We're now looking at a two-possession lead for the offense. Reynolds kicks it deep. Miller catches the kickoff. And he's brought down after a return of 23. Overall today, they've been outperformed on offense. It's time for them to buckle down and get things moving if they want any chance of turning things around. He hands it off. Further back to pass. The receiver can't bring it in. Third down and short. Tonight. Shaking off the tackler. Blocking can be one of the more overlooked aspects of running, but their impact on that first down run was pretty evident.
Tonight. Number 16, dropping back, play action fake. Second down. Second down. Number 16, dropping back. He's hit hard, and he'll be sacked down at the 28-yard line. That gets us to third down. Go! The offense with the play action. There's a penalty marker on the field, and he can't reel it in. We'll see if the penalty affects the outcome. The away team accepts the penalty. That contact was clearly after the five yards, which is why the flag was thrown. Sit hut. Tosses the ball past the first down. He can't make the catch. Coming out in the gun. He steps back to pass. Launches a pass. He's tackled by Jackson. That'll give them a fresh set of downs. A two tight end set for the offense. Go! He hands it to the runner. That brings up second down. He drops back. The away team will fake the handoff and look to pass. He can't make the catch. He drops back. Sets his feet and throws. He makes the catch in the end zone for a touchdown. Dave, that's what it's all about. Sure, it goes down as a TD for the QB, but the WR did a lot of work on it, too. Go! Number five kicks it up, and it's good! The away team reclaims some lost ground. 33-27. We got us a nail-biter of a game today, Dave. It's anyone's game now. The kick sails deep. Number 87 takes the kick. Makes the return up to the six. The third quarter comes to a close. The home team out in front for now, 33-27. The home team will begin the drive from the seven-yard line. Oh. Hurls a pass, and he misses his mark. Second down. Go. Number 15 drops back. That brings up third down. Tonight. Dropping back. Throws the ball down the middle of the field. The receiver can't bring it in. When it's third and long, sometimes you've got to throw it downfield, even when you know that's exactly what the defense is expecting. It just didn't work out for them at that time. Number 14, punts it away. Howard takes the kick. Makes the return up to the 48-yard line. This is a good position for offense to be in. It's a one-score game, and they've got a good opportunity to go down the field and get some points. The running back takes the handoff. The handoff is taken by number 37. This line today, regardless of who is in the backfield, they're making it a point to create those running lanes. Dropping back. 
He hurls one. He, he makes the catch in the end zone for a touchdown. Carter had the Jets on from the moment the ball was snapped. He wasn't going to stop until he had that ball in the end zone. Tonight. The kick is up. It's good. The away team will pull ahead with the score 34-33. The lead changes the mindset for both the offense and defense. I wonder if we won't see some guys taking more risks. Number five kicks it. The return man catches the kickoff. And he's brought down after a return of 22. The home team has to feel good about where they are. They're down by a single score and are in control of what happens next. We've got an injured player down on the field. Gardner on the carry. Bring up third down. That'll bring up a fresh set of downs. A successful rushing attack makes the defense pull that eighth man into the box, which then opens up the passing game. He drops back to pass. Play action fake. And he's taken down up at the six-yard line. The offense is giving the chain gain a workout down there. They were barely set before needing to move. Hey. Number 15, dropping back. He flings a pass. The pass falls harmlessly to the ground. Makes the toss to number 23, and he's in for the score. The linemen take pride in that kind of play. The defense brings out its best gap filters, and the back still finds a way in. The kick is made. It's good. The home team will pull ahead with the score 40-34. The fans are starting to get into it, Dave. They know that we've got a great game today. The kick sails deep. The away team has to feel good about where they are. They're down by a single score and are in control of what happens next. Hike. Number 16 gives it away. That will bring up second down. Second down. Hike. Makes the handoff to number 37. That gets us to third down. Third down. <laughs> he flings a pass. He's brought down by number 53. First down. Number 16, back to pass. And that's enough for a first down. Those D linemen are lobbying for holding, hoping the refs can stop the momentum this offense is building. complete to number eight that'll give them a fresh set of downs you know dave 
you can only go from first down to first down so many times before it turns into points on the board. The QB drops back. He throws one off to the left flat. That gets us to second down. Tight end on the right side. Right. Number 16, looking to pass. That will bring up third down. Number 16, hands it off. That will move the chains. Blocking can be one of the more overlooked aspects of running, but their impact on that first down run was pretty evident. Hike! The quarterback handing it off. Second down. Second and goal for the offense. Tonight. The running back takes the carry. That gets us to third down. Tonight. Touchdown! Simple X's and O's. And in this case, the offense just found a weakness in the D and got rewarded with six points. Number five makes the kick. And it's good. The away team will pull ahead with the score 41-40. Look out, Dave. We've got a great finish to this game coming here, I think. Number five rockets this one deep. Let's see what the offense can do with this drive. I'm sure they'd love to go down and put an end to this lead they're facing. Tonight. Steps into the pocket. He turns it upfield. Second down. Second down and short. Tonight. He launches one. And he steps in for six. Touchdown. We talk to other coaches in the league, Dave, and they tell us this guy's a real threat. He just showed us why. Go. Drops back into the pocket. The home team can't convert the two-point try. The home team takes the lead, 46-41. Great teams are able to come through in clutch moments. I'm excited to see how this one finishes up. Let's see what the offense can do with this drive. I'm sure they'd love to go down and put an end to this lead they're facing. What deep off to the left side that will move the chains great anticipation by the quarterback to throw it where the receiver needed to be uh -huh. makes the throw past the first down he can't bring it in He flings a pass out past the first down marker. The away team takes a timeout here. That gets us to third down. Uh -huh. Steps into the pocket, throws a pass, and he can't reel it in. 
When it's third and long, sometimes you've got to throw it downfield, even when you know that's exactly what the defense is expecting. It just didn't work out for them at that time. It drops back into the pocket. Pulled in by number eight. The home team will start from the 22. The away team will call timeout. Second down. Second down. The handoff is taken by number 23. The away team will call their third and their final timeout here. Third down. That's a safe play on third down. When you've got a long way to go, sometimes you're better off just picking up a few yards and kicking it. Mike, you know what time it is. We're all anxious to hear who you've got as the stud of the game. Who is it? Today's stud is Gardner for the home team. Talk about a guy that loves football. It really showed on the field today. 